What's going on on YouTube? Um, so today I'm bringing you a top 10 review and predictions. Um, I haven't made the brackets yet, but I'll show you guys the brackets too. Um, so as you guys remember, I do this top 10 review and man, it was another tough decision. There was probably, I think, 30, 30 clips I had a, I had to fight over top 10. But um, I think you guys will enjoy these top 10s. And um, for loser grand finals and grand finals, I will do just a top 10 or top 5, depending, because there's only two matches going on. You'll see Jake versus Alex, and the winner of that will be taking on Tokes. And I'll tell you my predictions at the end of the video, so stick around and enjoy these top 10. Peace. All right, so here I'm going to finally show you guys the top 10 in the first clip, number 10. We have Jacob going in with the FAL. You see the score, 25-17. This is an absolute credible clip. <clears throat> I just, the FAL is, is an insane, especially for this map. You can shoot anyone. He just jumps, shoots, shoots her. She, he ends up winning the game. Now here, you'll see Alex, she throws a stun, 29 21 she ends the game right here she stuns him she knows he's full stun pushes him gets the kill secures the victory that has to be number nine for me it's a it's an incredible play so now number eight you'll see gg going in she sticks the kill here at number eight and then she runs around finds him again and then i think she finds him one more time right here yep Real quick, easy peasy for her. 25-17. She will go on to lose this game, um, but she had some incredible plays. Uh, she had easily, I think, what did I have right down? Seven, seven good plays from her. And unfortunately, I can't always pick all seven. You know, we only got top ten. So, GG, that was a hell of a good job. And then number seven, Afro, he's just, it's incredible. He's got a very good skill base. And then this drop shot you'll see from him from range with an MP5. He's got, he's got an incredible skill. And number six, you see a little bit of lag here, but the goy boy, Ethan, he's losing 14 to 24. I mean, you can almost tell that it's, it's game. He gets a beautiful drop shot on on the tokes I mean that was just a beautiful play from him and number five is definitely one of my favorites Alex runs out of ammo and has to use a 1911 to get the kill absolutely insane kill number four definitely securing the victory there has to be number four and then again we have Jacob with the FAL just coming in so hot so clean waiting for his kills 10 to 7 here, and then you'll see him jump. He sees her, finds the kill again, 11 to 7. He was just still on a rampage. And I know you guys missed it a little bit there, but if you guys could watch the map and, and, and back it up a little bit, you'll see that Tokes actually heard him and did a complete U-turn, a complete 360, and then just turns and kills him. Absolutely incredible play. And then number one, Alex. This is uh, this has to be number one for me. It has to be. It's eleven to twelve. She was struggling, and then she just she gets on a hot streak. And right there, twelve twelve. To me, that has to be number one, only because of of how how good how good she was playing. So other than that, that's that's what I have for you guys for top ten. You guys can uh, can hear my reactions real quick now, so I uh, hope you guys enjoy this. Damn! Just as soon as she gets rolling, she was predicting him being there though. Oh, she it's Jake! One more, she's facing Jake. Stuns him. Uh oh. Uh oh. That is game. Oh. She shuts it down. Uh oh. 
Be a little hot streak from VG going here. Woo! Damn. Uh oh. Oh. Focus on one direction too much. That's what happens. She's always like that in every match. Damn, Afro with the drop shot. That could be the dagger right there. Ooh, I don't know. If, I hope that was mine. Get back, but I do believe he's one of them players that could bring it back. Oh, what the mom? Pistol? Look at I fucking clutch me. Game over. Really down. Oh! Another good play. Here comes a 360. Oh, that's just nasty. That is nasty. Oh! It's 11 to 12. Holy shit. We got a game. Oh my god. Oh, yes, you heard me say. Don't ask me. I couldn't speak. It was 12 12. She was not. She was not playing her game. And then I think she just. I don't know. A light, a light bulb just went off. And she just flicked. But I, I hope you guys enjoy that. Top 10. Hope you guys enjoyed that top 10 because I know it took me a little bit to choose who should get top 10. And, uh, well, let's get on with the predictions now. All right. So here we have the loser bracket. That way you guys can see a, a good picture of it. We have Afro, Alex, Gigi, and Jake. Um, as you see, Alex won 30 to 21, <clears throat> um, and Gigi lost to Jake 17 to 30. Now, Alex is facing Jake in what I would consider the loser grand finals. Um, it's a little different than what it should be, but it's we lost a player, so we're not we, we didn't lose too bad of a player that way. Um, we can still play the way we're supposed to um, because Alex and Jake can now, instead of being the loser semifinals, it'll be the loser grand finals. Um, since Dylan didn't show up, um, I, he's not dropping out of the, the winner's bracket to face the winner, the winner here. So they just have a shorter road. That's all that is um, to make it easier. But you see, Alex will be facing jake and my predictions there i'm obviously going to be predicting jake we will probably have a brother grand final brother versus brother so stay tuned for the grand finals in general whoever it may be um and i told them i would predict a score so my score prediction will probably 30 to 14 30 to 13 somewhere in there um and i'll show you the winners bracket here you had Ethan who took place of Dylan um, he lost 14 to 30 on shipment shipments not his favorite map at all so there you see Toke sitting and waiting in the grand finals um, the loser from the loser bracket to the winners bracket Tokes has to lose twice to lose it all if he loses the first time, it will be all right for him. He will have to play again. That would bump him down to one loss because the losers is coming with one loss and Tokes is undefeated right now. So it's not fair for him to have a one and done. So what's going to happen with that is if Jake happens to beat Alex, he will have to beat Tokes twice in order to win the entire tournament. So I'm super excited for that. And the reason I'm pushing for this tournament to be done is we're having a 2v2 tournament. So you guys need to stay tuned for that. That is going to be on fire, guys. It will be on fire. So stay tuned for that. So um, let's get on with Alex and Jake. And uh, let's see who wins that. That video will be posted here very shortly. So I hope you guys enjoyed.
this here review predictions uh, I really hope you guys enjoyed the top 10 peace out guys